soon. Oh, all right, here we go. All right, Matador and Zexy facing off. All right, so here we are on Pokemon Stadium 2, because why would we be anywhere else? Matador starting this game off with a pretty big conversion. Oh, and he gets a uh, forward tilt on the Mistech there. He's got quite a lead to start this game off. And there's a stock. Matador looking very good. I feel like he used to go to the same event so often, but I feel like they have to have played recently. I know Matador is, uh, he's been messing around with a lot of secondaries. I've seen the, uh, the Mario in bracket as well. And Zexy has evened up the stocks real quick. Yeah, these two have a very contested record. Uh, Zexy's up six to five. And he's taken the last two sets. But uh, Matador trying to uh, even up the head-to-head -head here. He's looking pretty good. Up to Waft sends the wrong way. Finds an up smash. The way he's been playing right now, he probably won't need the Waft. However, if, uh, if Zexy starts to make a comeback here, it could get a little bit sketchy. Down to dash stack, finishes it off though, barely. Matta has found himself a lead and he's going to try and extend it as far as he can. He probably will not be seeing it, definitely not on a full waft this game, but uh, ideally you'd clean this up even before you have to start worrying about the uh, the half. But right now, Zexy is, uh, finds that up smash, barely not killing. Yeah, uh, Young Link has a absurd a smorgasbord of kill confirms. But the, uh, the lucky thing if you're playing against the Young Link is that they don't kill until relatively late percentage-wise. And a lot of them are positioning dependent. So if you just kind of pick your spots correctly, you might not die until you're pretty late. Of course, even if you avoid one kill confirm, uh, Young Link's just going to throw out 50 more uh, projectiles, which will also all lead into kills if they hit you. But right now, Matador has been avoiding it very well. And right as I say that, he gets boomeranged into an up air. Now Zexy's got another chance, but enough time has passed that you got to be thinking about the half waft, and you definitely got to be thinking about the back air, and you super got to be thinking about not double jumping out of the corner. Everyone in this region does it. Sorry, just taking a moment to complain about how everyone in this region double jumps out of the corner and keeps dying because of it. Matador uh, using the bite to actually eat the arrow. Kind of a weird interaction that you're not going to see too much, but uh, can't happen. Oh no! Okay, but he kept his jump. He was able to make it back. Neftil trying to get another one, but Nuck doesn't find it. I don't know why he's going for down smash and ledge that move is not good. It's fair. That time, Sexy actually goes a little bit higher than Matador was expecting. Pair me up smash, there we go. Look, Willow, the only reason I ever take games off of anyone is because they're addicted to double jumping out of the corner and I just call it out with back air and they die at 70, okay? People should never lose to me, but they do because they have that habit. Sexy finds an up smash. Also, I do it all the time too, but I'm not good. So if you're good, then you don't have an excuse. These, uh, these forward airs that Matador has been working into his game have really been causing a lot of trouble for Zexy. He's just kind of playing in a range where he's susceptible to it. 
Yeah, uh, what would scab in chat? Wario down smash is a very bad move. Don't, if you play Wario, don't, don't press that button. <laughs> There's seldom a reason to. Kill's super late too. It just isn't really very good at anything. And Matador trying to cover options there, but instead he's just gonna get up smashed and zexy has got a lead here in game two. Let's try to turn this into a best of five. Zexy back air. Unable to really extend it. Got the weak hit of the dash attack, barely missing out on what would have been a kill. And now Zexy is doing what he does best, just kind of pestering Matador and getting that percent as high as possible, but he does fall to that back air. Yeah, there is again trying to use that forward air, that time trading weirdly with the up special. And the up smash is gonna finish it off. Zexy takes it. In this game, this set is now best of five. These two are no strangers to playing a bunch of best of fives. Almost every set that they've played has been a best of five. Recently at the ladder and at the cave, uh, Zexy has been the one to take it. Loser's bracket update, Train taking a 2-0 over Ruse, knocking out at a unfortunate 17th. But Train is going to be trying to run like a train through Losers after getting upset by Ragnarok early on. Bit of a conversion by Matador there. Makes sense, it's just about even. Got the falling up air, wasn't able to get it into the back air. And instead, he gets up the up air and nearly loses his stock for it. And the arrow up air, he's gonna finish Matador off. Jaxi once again with the lead. Is it back air? And another back of the ledge, just not taking it by just a little bit. And then down air, finishes Zexy stop. Ada has evened it up. Using the drag down to the forward air to get a grab. Up special, you know, up air. Oh! And the boomerang into the up B is gonna take it. Zexy is up an entire stock. Looking pretty unstoppable here. The clap actually beating out the down air. I feel like that's one of the few moves I've seen outrange that. Interesting to know that that's how that interaction goes. Very difficult to punish that. Uh, oh, he just went for a raw up tilt. He knew he needed to find his way back in the game, and that's how he was trying to do it. He still could punish that. There's a deck, uh, dash deck though. I'm trying to keep sexy off stage. Instead, he gets up beat. Down air. Mata finds the dash tag. Not great DI, but Zexy's still able to survive. He's got to get this stock off now if he wants any chance of winning this. Instead, he's just going to jump right into a forward air. Zexy just kind of threw that out. Got him with a bomb all the way up there, and the down air is going to finish it off. Zexy goes up 2 1 in the set. First, this is flex best of five, which means that this is now best of five.
just changing the uh, the overlay to reflect their skins because it's fun. All right, Zexy Matador, game four, back to PS2. Once again, Matador does not go anywhere else if he can help it. But it does feel like it's giving Zexy a lot of room to run away. Although right now he's mostly been in Matador's face at the start of this game. Yeah, Gap, this event is, like, so stacked. I went 0-2, losing to Ray and Murin. That's not normal. <laughs> there are so many good players here. And two of the best facing off here in winner's quarters. Zexy takes first blood with the, uh... Who's down here? I know, right, Willow? I got games off both of them, too. I'm so mad. It's okay. Matador going high with the, uh, the up there, just to poke above the ledge. And the falling forward air into the dash stack is going to seal it out. But Matador is behind by so much. Uh, I feel like if we get for the up air, maybe it can take the stock, but the, the forward air is not. It's still great damage. It's actually narrowing out of the fake combo. Oh! He's actually going super deep for that forward air finds the stock. And he just has to take one more to make it in top eight. And again, Matador missing the up uh, the up air in a walk conversion. He's actually barely able to make it back. And Matador ran all the way to the other side of the stage looking for his bike and he didn't find it. And that allowed Zexy to get up. That was the worst DI I've ever seen. He still lived. Back air gonna seal it out. Matador with one more shot, but no waft on the table. And yeah, he is just jumping in a projectile after projectile, gets this bite. Trying to find a dash stack, doesn't get it. And falls out. Oh, falling up air? Yeah, not able to get much. Oh, actually using the back hit of the boomerang to combo. He's threatening with these up airs, but uh, Matador able to find his way around him. That quick forward air. Down tilt, up air. There we go, Zex, he's got it. 3-1 over Matador after losing the first game, staying strong, forcing it into a best of five and winning 3-1.